Hey, it's Mark from Training Spark. In this video, we're going to show you how you can integrate Learn Dash with a plugin called the Events Calendar. Now, you may be aware of this, but Learn Dash is part of a group of plugins owned by a company called Stellar WP. And one of the other plugins that Stellar WP own is called the Events Calendar. And this is a plugin for creating events on your WordPress platform and perhaps taking payments for them and, and having tickets and things like that. So it's intended for perhaps live events or face-to-face -face events uh, that you can then sell tickets for. And it's a good companion for LearnDash because more and more people are creating a blend of online courses with some live element to them. So you might have Zoom calls that people book onto that has a companion online learning course. So I wanted to show you how you can link these two using an add-on that LearnDash have created for this. So just to show you basically what you have with the events calendar, once you've got that installed, you would have an events option here where you can create events in your platform and you can have attendees and create sort of capacity for your events, start dates, end dates, and things like that. So we might go more into detail about what event, the events calendar can do in some other videos further down the line. But for now, I just wanted to focus on the integration between that and LearnDash. So the way these uh, show up on the, um, you know, to a, to a front end user, I'll just open this in a private tab so you can see this. So you have an event like this, and you can have links that allow people to add them to calendars, have free access where they sort of RSVP to things, as well as having ticketed access to things where people can buy tickets and pay for them via a checkout. So what I'm going to do here is link that with a LearnDash course. And to do that, what we need to do is install a LearnDash add-on by going to LearnDash LMS and then add-ons. And we're going to browse for one called LearnDash LMS, the events calendar integration. So we'll just install that here by clicking on this option and that'll just download and be added to our platform. And then we need to activate it. Once that's activated, we won't really see any difference in our interface here, but when we go to an event and then edit the event, what we'll find is that the event settings are all the same, but if we scroll down, now that we've got that in plugin, the add-on installed, we have this option for Learn Dash integration, which allows us to enroll people onto one or more courses or groups when they register onto this event. So to give this a try, what I'm going to do is say, when I want when someone registers onto this event, I also want them to en be enrolled onto the Healthy Eating for Healthy Life course. So we'll just go back up and update that now. And what I'm going to do to test this is just switch to my private tab here and scroll down and book onto this event. And we'll just buy a, a, you know, a fake ticket for this. So what you do as part of events, the events calendar is um, say who's buying it. So um, let's make up an address here. So I just made up an email address there to try this with. And I have this in um, like a sandbox mode, which means that you can put in a dummy uh, credit card number. So uh, that's not a real one. And now we just click purchase tickets. And what we're doing here is booking onto that event. So we're buying access to it. And we get our order completed here and some details about it. 
But what I'm going to do is show you that as part of this, uh, if I head to mailinator.com, we will have received an email address saying we've got tickets, but also we will have been given access to the course as well. So if I switch back to here and head to the users, what we'll find is that we have a, a user here, a Mark Ticket Test 06. So that was the one who just bought. And if we scroll down, we can see that they've automatically been given access to this Healthy Eating for Healthy Life course. So they can go on and get started with that online course. And that is the, the combination of the face-to-face -face event and the online. So I hope you find that useful. And like I, mentioned, like I mentioned previously, we'll probably do some more videos on the events calendar, just showing some of the more, some of the, some more of the features on it and uh, how you can create face-to-face -face events as a, as a companion to your online courses. And if you'd like to see more like this, please subscribe to the Training Spark YouTube channel.